right, you all, we got a, we got some watch faces we want you guys to check out that I thought was nice to have in your archives. This one is called Analog Basic 13. I thought this was definitely a good look for an analog watch face. I like the look of the analog hands, very stylish, very nice. I don't know if this is a dress up watch face or uh, not for the most part, but definitely a nice casual dress down wear for the work week or for a casual weekend. Now we do have only the 12 so far as the number is concerned. I thought that was unique. You got this sports look that's taking place around the index, right? Which really looks nice, makes this watch face stand out. You got your date information, you see January up at the top. If you look into the dial, right, over to the left, it looks nice. You get your date information. You also got the days of the week surrounding it, which really looks nice so far. The detail is concerned. You got your battery info, your goal uh, completed thus far. This is nice, right? I put Bixby in there just to be doing something. I don't use Bixby. But if you come down, as you can see, you got your heart rate information, battery info. You got everything you need within a watch face, right? It's right here. And then, of course, I got my... Spotify, I got my YouTube that I can go in at any given time, right? Which I love. But let's take a look and see what we can do uh, to personalize this a little bit more, right? Uh, and this is what the developer gives us. Now, you can dim this down uh, in the AOD mode, uh, and you get quite a few things you can dim down as we go across uh, this watch face, right? So we're not going to go into any of those things. Um, we will go into the colors because I believe they have some nice colors for you to customize this to. I mean, you get enough, right, to match up with what you may have on for the day, which I thought was pretty cool. Look at all the different colors, right? So if you want to tie this into your outfit, you can. As you can see, you get tons and tons of colors uh, to choose from. Just pick your favorite one, and you're all good to go. And then over here, you got all the compilation that you can ever set on your watch face. You get quite a few. I think you get like seven in all just to make it convenient to have on your wrist and you have a good look at the same time. So far as a nice, a nice analog watch face. All right, you all, let's check out this watch face. Now, this is by the same developer, right, that you've seen before. This one is called Analog Basic 14. Now, again, it's a nice, casual. Now, you will be able to get away with dressing up with this watch face, right? Of course, it has a sports look. You got some dials within this watch face. You got your traditional look of the index right that really makes it stand out and it still still has that sports look going around the bezel as well now i like the analog hands i chose red you are going to be able to customize the color theme of the analog hands as well got a nice second hand that's cruising around the bezel to watch data information is down at the bottom now i was able to set my weather within this watch face which was nice now you're also going to get your step information go completed everything you need for fitness is right here but it's a nice stylish analog watch face right but you are going to be able to customize this a little bit more than number one although i think number one looks better than uh number two but you got your colors and again you get a whole array of different colors that you could change to uh, on any given Sunday for what look you may want for that day. And it just kind of changes up the watch face, which I like, right? Tie it into the outfit you got on and just simply pick your your favorite color. Look at all the colors uh, you got going on here, right? Which I thought was nice. So this is a good look, right? So if we scroll over, you are going to be able to change the background color. Check this out, right? You get this stripe. I don't know. I don't know if some of you all really love this stripe or not, but if you want to change it and give it a different look, then you can, right? You don't have to stay with the same boring look from day to day. You can change it up and then you can dim the outer index. So if you need to dim that out, you can. Another thing that's nice, right? You are going to be able to dim the main screen as well. So if you're in a place that's dark and you really need to tone this down uh, quite a bit, you're going to be able to do so with this watch face, which I thought was awesome. And then you can dim down the AOD mode as well. But here you get so many different compilations that you're going to be able to set, right, to make the watch face as convenient as you need. I thought this was definitely a good look coming from the developer. But at the end of the day, what do you guys think? All right, so hold tight. We got another watch face for you guys to right, check guys, Let's out. check out this watch face. I didn't know if you guys slept on this one, but this one is definitely a nice watch face to have in your archives. I thought the developer really, really got down on this one, and the price should be set right as well. But let's go ahead. Let's check this one out. First of all, take a look at the index, right? I like the way the dots light up. They complement that deep blue in the background. And then look at the analog hands, right? That red is going to offset it. Now, it has a elegant look to it so far the analog hands are concerned and then you got a red tip 
on the second hand that's going around the bezel of the watch that really, really just complements this watch face overall so far as an analog watch face is concerned. Now, I like the fact that the dials are blacked out. The information is lit up in white, so therefore it makes it readable. It doesn't really overtake the background of the watch face. It really just complements it, which I thought was nice. You get that Timex look over to your right. That is nice, right? That's old school. And then, of course, uh, you got these dials. Now, up at the top, you are going to get uh, your Google Assistant. You also got your uh, battery info up at the top that I was able to add. So you can change the compilation uh, as you see fit. And then come down in the bottom dial. I do have my Spotify. You have your heart rate information. And over to the right, that dial just pretty much gives you the hour we're in at that particular time. Now, what I do like about this watch face, right, because on most watch faces, you get the 12, the 3, the 6, and the 9. On this one, you get the 2, the 4, the 8, and the 10, which just gives this a totally different look so far as the design is concerned. So I like it. I thought the developer really, really did a good job with putting different numbers on the watch face. But let's go in and take a look and see what we could do to complement, well, what we could do to uh, personalize this watch face just a little bit more. Now, here's what you can do, right? First of all, there's the color, right? The color is nice. So if you want that blacked out look, right, on any given Sunday to tie into any outfit you want uh, for the day, you can. And then, of course, that blue we were in, this red looks absolutely nice. I don't think it looks nicer than the blue, but you get quite a few colors uh, to change this watch face, too. You got a deeper black, which looks a lot better than, than the first black. And then here you got a different background. Now we're gonna leave it on that uh, when we come back and then you got that basic black. So black evidently uh, is a good color because it ties into whatever outfit you want on any given Sunday. But if you really just wanna change this up, you can. And I like the option that the developer gave us. And then here you got your brightness. I'm not gonna turn the brightness down, but I like the brightness, right? I mean, you can turn it black, but why not just go to another watch face, right? But if you're in that watch face, then you can customize it. Then the bezel, uh, you can change, right? So far as the color, uh, the dots that's lighting up around the bezel of the watch, which looks nice, right? We're going to leave it where it's at. And then here, you get the index that you can change. It might be going too fast, right? So you can change the index. And then here, you got your analog hands that you're going to be able to change. Uh, so far as the color is concerned, uh, to tie into that black background. And you see right here, it's just blacked out, right? Which looks really, really nice. Uh, we're going to leave it right there. And then here, you are going to be able to change some things, right? Uh, I don't really like that. You know, I think the developer could have kept that one. Um, but if you like it, you can go ahead and leave it on there. Then it adds another one at the bottom uh, of this date stamp information. So... I like it here. This has a more premium look so far as I'm concerned. And then here you get all the different compilations that you're going to be able to set for this watch face. Check it out, right? And then here you go. Voila. Let's take a look at that background, right? Look at the background. I really, really like that look. It stands out. It looks fresh. It looks premium. But at the end of the day, you all, it's going to be about you. What do you think of this watch face? Is it worthy of a download or not? All right, you all, that's going to be it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was informative. And if it was, please make sure you hit the like button on the way out. Smash that notification bell. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you all at the next one. Take care.